odds and ends. The idiom, odds and ends, is used to refer to various small, miscellaneous, or inconsequential things. It implies a collection of unrelated items or leftover bits that do not fit into a specific category or have any significant value individually. Here are a few examples to help illustrate its meaning. 1. I need to clean my room and organize all the odds and ends lying around. In this case, odds and ends refers to the various small items like pens, paper clips, and loose change that are scattered around the room and need to be tidied up. 2. I found some odds and ends in my attic, including old photographs, broken toys, and a few dusty books. Here, odds and ends describes the assortment of random items discovered in the attic none of which are particularly important or valuable. 3. Let's stop by the grocery store and pick up some odds and ends for dinner. In this example, odds and ends suggests buying a few miscellaneous ingredients or small items that are needed to complete a meal, such as spices, condiments, or snacks. 4. She has a drawer full of odds and ends in her office, like rubber bands, paper clips, and thumbtacks. This sentence implies that the person mentioned has a collection of small and unrelated items in their office drawer, which could come in handy for various tasks but don't have a specific purpose. Overall, odds and ends is a versatile idiom that can be used to describe a wide range of small, miscellaneous, and unimportant things. It highlights the idea of a collection of items that may not have much value on their own but collectively contribute to a larger whole.